All right, so we got all the panels that just about finished up on this thing for the bulletproofing. And then what we're doing next to this uh, squad car, uh, and this is kind of something that really pisses me off that the designers did. This is something I really don't like. I got three dogs, and with this whole cage, this, this cage is all steel, you know? So this car got, ever, got in a bad wreck, got hit. There's no pads. The dog's going right into metal, and I'm a dog guy, okay? I got three dogs. Uh, I'm the type of dude that rather hang out with his dogs than hang out with people. I'm a big time dog guy. So this really pisses me off. So what we're doing, we got four inch foam pad that we're gonna put on the ceiling. We got smaller pads that we're gonna put along the walls. So in case this thing ever gets hit, if the dog ever gets bounced around a little bit, it has some cushion. So I don't know what the designers were thinking about originally when they did this, but this like really like kind of like ticked me off with ha not having any pads in the scarf for this dog. You know, you just got it in a big metal box you know, to get shaken around and, you know, break its neck or something. So we got this heavy duty pad that we're gonna wrap all, the, that we're gonna get wrapped up with vinyl and everything like that so we can wash it off real easy. And we're gonna pad this all, all this thing out on top of all the bulletproof that we're doing before this thing. So if you're looking for any metal work, give me a call, 708-829-6734.